Hello, this is Jennifer with Women Loving Jesus, and today we're on Proverbs 8, 7. For my mouth shall speak truth, and wickedness is an abomination to my lips. As we read this, this is a little bit of a straightforward verse. It's basically saying that um, she wants her mouth to speak the truth and come from truth. And if there's any wickedness, it's an abomination to her lips. It's something that is detestable. That is something that is not even wanting to come near her lips. Like her lips are not going to speak anything that may be of wickedness because it's such an abomination to what is happening. Um, the next couple of verses, we're going to talk a little bit about this. The words we're speaking, whether they're from wickedness or if they're from truth. And so what I did is my spirit kind of had me look a little bit into God's word. Because what is truth? <laughs> a lot of people that may um, be confusing to some. But when we look in God's word, there is a definition of truth, believe it or not. Some of the Bible verses that I found about this is John 17, 17. Sanctify them in the truth. Your word is truth. So one of the first things we find out what truth is, is God's word. When we read scripture, what the scripture says, it's all truth. Um, the word of God has stood the test of time and speaks truth into all of our lives and gives us direction in which way we should go. The second verse that the spirit kind of pointed to me was Psalm 31, 5. Into your hand, I commit my spirit. You have ransomed me, O Lord, God of truth. So the second thing we find is that God himself is truth. We have his word, and then when we seek him through his word and prayer and turn our focus on and looking at him, we see the truth. We know the truth in the spirit that is connected to him. We know that as he directs us and as he shows us love, and as he speaks to us, it is truth. Because what God is, is truth. And that is something that does not change. So I pray that the Holy Spirit has guided you today and has encouraged you. And I thank you for watching.